Okay, so we've been asked to uh, give a little video about what we take and how we prepare for a slightly longer ride. So it's a little bit on the cuff, so excuse the shaky cam, but obviously gone over the bike, checked the tires for any wear and tear, lub cleaned, lubricated the chain. Me, I've cleaned the whole bike so now it's okay. Gone around all the nuts and bolts, make sure it's all, all okay. Check your hubs, seat's fine, the little saddlebag's fine. We've got the new Topeak. Um, gas tank there there's another video about that below and here's a little video of what I take so this is what I'm taking tomorrow it's a 300k ride so this doesn't include everything but just gives you an idea of what I'd take so obviously the helmet got the sunnies I run a Bluetooth earpiece just on one side I prefer that rather than having uh, headphones both sides got the Wahoo got a battery pack which is also solar chargeable uh, some cash, got the credit card and the debit card in there. Uh, contact lens case, little multi tool, some extra chamois cream, some bars. That's not all of them, it's just for demonstrations. We've got two, three bar, Nutrigrain bars, little bag there for an, uh, another battery pack I'm just going to try tomorrow. Some handy wipes if you've used toilet, washrooms, whatever, or just have a clean yourself up a bit in the saddle bag, spare tube, tire levers, little puncture patch repair kit, quick link in case the chain snaps, high efficiency pump, and on the bike, running the gas tank, Topi gas tank up on the head tube. I like this so we can have the phone in there. You've got a little spot on the side here, you can put cash cards. I like the uh, battery pack in here, and then obviously that can come out on the side here charge the lights on the go and even the wahoo running two lights on the front it's gonna be early when we set off maybe late when you come back then also on the back got one light on the back here another one down here and everything's high vis okay some other little things taken into consideration is how long is the ride tomorrow's ride is going to be about two to three hundred kilometers so factor in if you know roughly what your average speed is Divide that by how far you're going, gives you a rough idea of how long you're gonna be out on the bike. So don't disappear out on the bike at midday. Doing 200K, knowing you, you average 15K an hour, you're gonna be out for a very long time. So tomorrow we're gonna to be up and out, hopefully by 5 a.m. And we'll see how it goes. Top tip that I quite like, I've found it helps me if you're a real planner, is laying everything out the night before or having it all on the bike. Uh, so you know earlier on if you've forgotten something. So uh, I always manage to forget the wahoo or forget to put the helmet somewhere. And uh, you know, so I lay it all yeah, out. Like you've got all your stuff ready to go. You've got your wahoo on. You know, your gloves are there ready to go. Your tank bags, got your bits and pieces, charging cables, multi-tool, credit card, key. You've got a rain jacket if you're gonna take it. Shoes with socks. And then I have a little stand here where I've got the shorts and bibs ready to go, the jersey, uh, headband because I sweat a lot, and even your, uh, your helmet, keys ready to go, and then some other bits and pieces you're going to put in the back of your jersey. So you've got your sunglasses, earpiece, I carry wet wipes, and uh, contact lens case, some extra cream, a couple of bars, but there's going to be more of them. And uh, that way you're ready to go, and most importantly, chamois butter. So anyway, that's us ready for tomorrow, aiming to do the 300.